Hey, good morning, folks, and welcome again to another exciting episode of Friday with Fran, the real estate man. And wow, where did October go? We are going to be celebrating this guy real soon, uh, but we can celebrate him this week and because it's National Pumpkin Day. Um, we certainly uh, have a little bit of a pumpkin craze going on here in uh, our neck of the woods with a lot of the fast food chains, Dunkin uh, and uh, Starbucks here, every little bit of pumpkin in the morning. Um, but so that's kind of a, <clears throat> a new craze. They're calling it the pumpkin spice craze. Put a little pumpkin in anything. But anyway, pumpkins go back uh, oh, a long time ago, uh, probably back to more of like the 1600s, uh, where the tradition of carving pumpkins and jack-o'-lanterns actually was happened in Ireland. And it was about a story about a stingy guy, Jack. And there, that's why we come up with the term Jack O'Lantern. So look that one up there. Um, and uh, we here also know that uh, pumpkins, when we carved them, uh, when the, uh, the you know, Mayflower came over here and the uh, pilgrims were around, uh, they would actually put them out uh, to ward off evil spirits as well. Uh, we kind of decorate them with the kids now for fun, uh, doing a little bit more ornate. Uh, but that's kind of a little bit of the history of the Jack O'Lantern. So let's talk about month supply and inventory in September. Uh, it's 1.52, uh, which changed over the last month up 5.6, but over the last 12 months it's uh, back up um, 20.6. So we are seeing some homes out there uh, staying out there a little bit longer. Some of that's because they're overpriced. Uh, uh, other than that, uh, we really see that the market still is continuing pretty well, um, but um, hopefully we will we'll see a little bit spurt up when the interest rates drop, most probably after the election. Um, want to do a little fun thing here. Uh, if you're around on Monday uh, over at our office in Lafayette Hill, I'll be there. Uh, we are doing what they call a trunk or treat so the kids can come by uh, from uh, 4 to 6.30. Uh, right up, it'll be getting dark by that time. Um, but we have those that time period slotted. Uh, you can park in the Ale House uh, or the uh, side of that. Uh, if you care to, it's right there at Joshua Road and Germantown Pike, our new office there in uh, Lafayette Hill. So that's it. Uh, and uh, you have to have your costume on, of course. So uh, anyway, a lot of information, uh, both uh, jack-o'-lantern-wise, but also the inventories out there. When you want to talk about things real estate, uh, I am around now and between the, the trunk and treat. But anyway, if you have anything there, a uh, lot of business going on out there. Um, I actually have a, a closing uh, later today, uh, one on Tuesday, and then another one on the following uh, Monday. So uh, life is uh, moving along, as they say, in the fall market. So anyway, you take care, and I thank you again for watching another exciting episode of... Friday with Fran, the real estate man. Y'all take care. We will see you next week.